What's going on guys, this is Joe Young coming at you with a video today. Today's going to be something a little different. Uh, today I'm going to be talking about three things that will increase your ammonia levels in your planet tanks. A couple weeks ago I had a small uh, ammonia spike in my discus tank and it got me thinking um, what actually caused it and how you can actually prevent it. Alright, I'm going to go over three things that could be a factor in the increase and for me, um, this was the case, so I'm going to show you guys how to prevent it as well. Alright, so starting with number three is an unsiphoned substrate. So with planet tanks, a lot of people don't siphon their substrate. Um, that goes with me, but what can actually happen is the fish, eventually the waste is going to accumulate a lot faster than what the tank and plants can actually consume and break down. So once in a while you actually have to gravel back the top layer of your substrate to help prevent that. Alright, so number two, stuck in uneaten food. This uh, occurs when you have a pretty dense planted tank or certain plants like, for example, chiponicas. Um, I know in my case, um, I had this occur when I had a bunch of japonicas as a carpeting plant and the flakes would get stuck in between the plant and it would actually get stuck all the way down where the fish can't even get to it. And with that, the, the food would just sit there and rot and decay and basically increase your ammonia. A good way to avoid this is to feed in small portions and in terms of portion control. So for example, you know, take a pinch, throw it in there, let your fish eat everything and then throw another pinch. Another thing you can do is increase the flow of the tank uh, to help kick up the debris. Um, this way it allows at least the food to be kicked up into the water uh, column to allow the fish to eat it. Alright, so number one is old and decaying plant matter. I know for myself, uh, I tend to just leave the plants in there even though I see like floating leaves, um, you know, stems kind of dying. The best way for this is just keep up with your maintenance. So if you do a water change every week or every two weeks, make sure you remove any dead plant matter because that would definitely increase your ammonia levels. All right guys, so those are three things that will increase your ammonia levels in your planet tanks. Obviously there's a lot more that it actually can contribute to the increase in ammonia. Um, if you guys have any ideas or any other things, leave it in the comments below. And peace guys.